Hello and welcome back to yet another Hearts of Iron 4 video. This time, we're going to play as Mexico because, really, I've never played as it before. So you know what, let's, let's honestly just give it a try. So this mod, I'm doing mode to 56, and you know what, since I've never given it a try, and I don't know what's going to happen, I'm not going to do Iron Man mode. Yes, this is like once in a lifetime, I'm not going to do Iron Man mode, I'll probably do it for, I will probably won't do it for other things, but you know what? You know, let's just not do Iron Man mode today. So this focus tree is actually very, very extensive. I'm pretty sure this is also a base game focus tree. And I don't know what to do, uh, to be honest. Now it looks like we have all of this church power where we can do special church stuff. And I'm pretty sure if we get below a certain, for like a certain church, then uh, we go into a civil war, which I, I would really not like to happen as Mexico. Now, let's see what happens if I unpause the game. Uh, Okay, so, Rebellion, 150 days. Cloud attention is moderate, attention is high. So, attention is moderate. How do I get rid of this? Oh, here we go. Sedio. Um, I can remove it. And I can support him or arrest him. So, what I heard, it's just better to arrest him. So, you know what? Plan of Agua Peria or whatever. whatever. I, I, I probably can't even say the name. And then Industry, Machine Tools, Construction, and Engineering. It's just... The, the base focus tree, uh, base, base uh, research tree. And so what I'm gonna go down is I'm actually going to go down this, uh, I'm, I did the control the army, but you know what, I'm gonna go down agriculture could a bigger liberal as a bank factor. Sure, let's get minus consumer good factories. Also, one other thing um, is that I need to get, uh, this is really cool. I can get marched down southward, so I get like, annex goals on all of these uh, Central American countries. Oh, wow. That's a lot of annex goals. Jeez. That's a lot of annex goals. Okay, well, I gotta do that. And also, what's the rebellion here? Let's see. The rebellion, I need to uh, train troops. So now we're basically rushing down the focus stream. We're gonna nationalize the oil fields, uh, which the US will get mad at, but they should not declare war on me. Now also, we have uh, Quado Rebellion, with Quado Tensions very high. Um, you know, I'm not sure if they're going to rebel. If they are, well, then that's a big F, but they should not rebel yet. Uh, let's get Dispersed Industry, and then let's get some uh, just the equipment stuff. Now, once we get down the focus, we'll be able to take down all of, should be able to take down this, and then we can take down these, and then um, hopefully fine. Okay, what is this? Powerful church. Okay, is it, okay, I usually have to click the top one. And, nothing, okay, no other special rebellion. Rebellion, good. So to get this really, really good focus, I need to go down uh, one of these, a uh, post-imperialism or German resource. So I get just licenses, which I really don't need. Oh, I give them right to my resource. No, thank you. I am not going to give rights to resources. Oh, and it's embargo. And now he revolts. Now I should be able to uh, put some units down. Whoa, 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 whoa. How does he already get a spawn units? What is this? How does he already get a spawn units? Uh, I'm in the Soviet Union. Oh, I'm in the commentary. Oh, that is that is very good. Now I'm, I'm just encircling these guys. It's kind of easy to encircle them. There we go. And then, uh, of course, he's going to attack here. Now I can just encircle them all the way over here. Uh, try to encircle them up here. Stop you from moving. Um, and stop the guy, whatever. So, um, we completed the, the Civil War's over. And uh, I need to march southwards. Um, which I need to be communist or fascist. Instead of going fascist, wait, what's, how, how do I get it quickly? Uh, can I get fascism quickly? Uh, red shirts, communi communist revolution. Oh, okay. I, uh, you know what? You know what? I know this has been done many times. Uh, let's just do, uh, what was it? Sure, communist revolution. So, I mean, all I really need to take is this city, which is the capital, and then I took this city. I had taken the city, and then I tried to get back, which, I mean, you saw, and then that was pretty easy. So, um, it, w it wasn't easy at the start because they had so many troops. Now, let's, let's get military factories, military factories, why not? 
And, ooh, this is not good production. I don't need dive bombers. Oh, I have two artillery production. Shoot. Fine, so be it, so be it. We'll have two artillery production, and yeah. So I did not know this, but uh, looks like we have 48% uh, for communism. Ooh, they're fascist. Uh, you know what? Let's actually just do this right away. Oh, I need to become communist. Oh, shoot, shoot, shoot. Communist revolution. And then I gotta go to uh, march southwards quickly, quickly, quickly. And now we are going to uh, try to declare war on Panama and take Panama. Hopefully we can take Panama. And, uh, okay, that is going the naval invasion. Hopefully they're not defending Panama. They are not defending Panama. There you go. Um, and can I, I probably could declare war on Colombia. Is that correct? Push the, okay. Mexico concession, fortify the canal, okay. Push past the Darazin Gap. Yeah, sure. Venezuela and all that stuff. Um, I don't think I need to go for the Caribbean, honestly, right now. I could... I do integrate all these, which are really... Mm, which are very decent, you could say. Uh, here we go. More, more, more. And more of this. Then let's just keep making these 20 width guys. Flop them out. Uh, just here we go. Boom. And you know what? Since I have Soviet Union, I could most likely, in this case, take care of America very easily. Do I? I think. You know, I think I will. So we've taken Colombia, Cuba, and yeah, I don't think I'm gonna expand anywhere over here yet. Uh, probably not at really at all, but uh, I'm going to take Haiti right now and uh, declare war. There we go. And also we are going not yet. Uh, let's let's get my navy out so we can win this battle right here. And also my air force, which I'll get out. And now I am going to do Operation Just Cause, where I start a border war with Panama. Uh, wait a second. It's supposed to be over here. What? It's, it's supposed to be right here? It, it's supposed to be with the whole of Panama, correct? Don't, don't end the border war. Don't end the border war. What? 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 what my, my division. Oh. Oh. Well, now the war begins with, oh no, they're doing a naval invasion. Oh god, are you... Okay, also, why did you guys leave? Why did you guys leave? Where are they doing the naval invasion? I can probably hold it off, especially because... Um, okay, just just go quickly. Just, just... Oh my god. Go, go quickly. Oh jeez. Go quickly, go quickly. There we go. Oh, they're gonna take all of... Okay, well, we should... Oh, they did a naval invasion behind me right here. Okay, well, you know what? Let's just get my submarine fleet. And let's combo raid right here. There we go. And, okay, they, sh they should take this. But, yeah, they, they aren't going to hold well for all any other stuff. So, yes, I know, I know, I know. What, what, I, what I did was, I know, it said the US joined the Allies, I actually just removed them from the Allies, nothing else. I just removed them from the Allies, I know it's a little bit cheating, I know it's a little bit, it kinda actually is cheating, but I removed them from the Allies, uh, because, uh, oh shoot, oh shoot, uh, oh, Soviet's defending it, oh, oh no, they aren't. Okay, well the reason I did that was because, otherwise, I guess you could say just, it would've been so long until they would've, uh, joined the Allies, oh, who is this being? Successor. Uh, sure, big successor. Who will it be? Uh, okay, good. Uh, revolutionary communist infrastructure construction. Okay, yeah, sure, sure. I want less occupation territory stuff. Okay. Um. So we started bad, but the Soviet Union just really helped. And like I said, I just did not let U.S. join the Allies. I know that's a lot of people are gonna get mad because of that. 
but you know, I, I just had to. Otherwise, I would have had I would have taken over U.S., and then I would have had to take over Canada, and then I would have had to somehow take over the U.K. and uh, France, and possibly even India if they became a major. Oh wow, uh, Hungary got taken over. Okay, now, oh okay, okay, come on, there we go. Now uh, I need to get. Uh, Colorado and Utah. I need to own Colorado and Utah, which is right here and right here. Uh, which I should, if I get Colorado, the, the little province of Colorado, Denver and uh, Salt Lake City. I don't even know why, but the ca amount of cash. Oh, who's just fighting against us? German Reich. Oh, gosh dang it. They're probably just fighting against, or are they actually doing. They actually may be doing uh, some against the common turn. I have no idea, though. Um, but I do not know how USA, like, no deployed forces at all. They had 180 casualties. It's like nothing. Okay, they have a good amount of forces over here. Um, yeah. I've literally just encircled the main ones on the front. But, like, that was a lot of troops still. That was a lot of troops. How have they only 200,000 casualties? And mine, the only way of been cheating is taking them out of the faction, but remember that's that's it. That's I'm I'm sorry, but um, what? I'm I'm so confused, and we're just honestly destroying the U.S. Jeez. And finally, we have uh, taken the U.S. Uh, I'm pretty sure Play Led Peace Conference is on, but you want to know? I'm gonna take uh all of the original territories. That I would have owned. This is Utah. That's Colorado. Here we go. Um, I forget what they what they owned. They did not. They didn't own Utah. They, well, they owned Colorado. Um, you know what? Let's just take. Let's take all of this. Arkansas, not Kansas. Boom. That's. This is the big Mexico. And then pass. And then you know what? The Soviet Union. You helped me. Oh, I don't want them to take all states. Uh, shoot, I, I, I don't want that. I don't want that. Uh, reset. Uh, I'm just... Fine. I'll puppet the United States myself. I'll put it, puppet it itself. Um, boom, puppet. And Satellite Republic of Philippines, sure. There we go. I get play a lot of these conferences, but like, I, I wish I could have puppeted them. And now we can just send our Mexican army over to help the Soviets, which... Ooh, Germany, man. You are not looking too good. You're not looking too good. Oh, wow. Yeah, they're definitely not looking... Oh, oh, they took the part of the Rhineland back. Ooh. Uh, I've done the re redeem at Slon or any... Or whatever the crap that is. Um, and then... I get cores on all of these places. Wow. Um, that's actually a really good focus. I'm pretty sure... I mean, these are all cores right here. Let's see my right territories. These should go away. Are these... There we go. Are, are the, aren't these cores? Hello? I mean, I just got cores in all these places, but... I'm not... Um... First off, I don't want that. And can I get military police? No, I don't have military police. Um... Well, at least I get all the factories in them, which... Eh, it's a good amount. It's, it's a good amount. Um... But... Yeah, this... This is honestly probably... Wait a wait a moment. Wait a moment. What happened? Why did US why did I I asked US for recognition, I said demand recognition from the US and, and then I just eat the US That wh wh what? I am so confused right now. Can I go back to another save? Can I go back to another save? What? You know what? I think this is where we're gonna end it off. I, I really don't... Mm, I don't know why that happened. I don't know why I just annexed the US. It literally just happened on camera, as you could see. But... Uh, you know what? Fine. So be it. So be it. Fine. And, uh... Th yeah, just... just Thanks, thanks, thanks for watching. And we left her in good hands. All in all, not bad. Not bad at all.
And so, goodbye, God bless you, and God bless the United States of America.